Thank you, Senator Kittner. Senator Karpyshek, you're recognized. Thank you, Mr. President, members of the body. Senator Kittner can't help but step on another landmine, chastising the body again. Senator Kittner, would you yield to a question, please? Senator Kittner, will you yield? You know, I'd love to. Good. Did you vote for the airplane yesterday, a new air jet, three point some million dollars for the governor? I did not vote for a jet, I voted for a turboprop, yes I did. Okay, very good, and that, so that's really gonna protect one person pretty much, right? That is a tool, it's an asset to be used by our state. There are lots of tools in, here, in Senator In the business Kittner. Of, of our state. Whatever, thank you. Look. It's not time to be chastising the body again. We're talking about real lives and real kids here. And if we want to talk about bureaucrats, we could find a whole bunch of them. This is talking about trying to keep our kids safe. I want to talk about Lucas Bowers, a young man from Wilbur, Nebraska, that took his own life in December. That's what it means to me to spend money. I have voted for each and every one of Senator Kittner's bills that he brought here to take away a bunch of money this year out of the budget. We all did because there were none. But yet we constantly have to hear this sort of thing. We are talking about people I'm coaching Legion baseball this year, and hopefully Senator Kittner won't come down and umpire a game. But Lucas would have been my starting pitcher. He won't be, because something went wrong, and no one knows what. Great kid, great family, great student, probably headed to college to play some, some sports. But something went wrong. And if you want to walk into a small town auditorium and see about a thousand bawling people at a funeral for a young man that should be here with us today, it's no fun. And it's senseless. And if there's anything we can do to help them out so we're not in that situation again, by God, I'm all for it. And we talk about spending other people's money here. Guess what? We all pay taxes. Some of us a lot less than others. We all pay taxes. And it is the state's money, obviously. I'm tired of being chastised for trying to stand up and stick up for people. I don't go out and try to rile people up and say, boy, did you see what they did today? They spent all this money and I told them not to. Bring a bill to cut these things. I will forever remember Lucas Bowers Larrington, Larrington Bowers, excuse me. And if this bill can do one little thing to help the next Lucas not end up in this same spot, I will. This is ridiculous. It is shameful to use this sort of rhetoric minute. when we're talking about real people. I just can't believe that we would stoop to that level. This is a wonderful bill. We get off subject about arming teachers. Maybe we should, maybe we shouldn't. I don't think it's a great idea. But let's please pass this bill and stop the kind of nonsense that we've been hearing. Thank you, Mr. President. Thank you, Senator Karpyshek. Senator Bloomfield, you're recognized.